Once upon a time, in a small village nestled among the serene mountains, lived a wise old monk named Master Hikaru. He was known throughout the region for his deep wisdom and peaceful demeanor. People would often seek his guidance and enlightenment. One day, a troubled young woman named Mei arrived at the monastery in search of answers to the turmoil within her heart. Mei approached the humble abode where Master Hikaru resided and bowed respectfully before him. With a gentle smile, the old monk welcomed her and motioned for her to sit beside him in the tranquil garden. The soft sound of a nearby flowing stream brought a sense of calmness to their conversation. Master Hikaru, Mei began, her voice filled with desperation, I am lost and confused. I've been carrying a heavy burden within my soul, and I cannot find peace. The old monk nodded compassionately, his eyes reflecting the depth of his understanding. Tell me, young one, what weighs so heavily upon you? May's voice trembled as she spoke of her past mistakes, regrets, and the endless stream of negative thoughts that tormented her. She had lost faith in herself and felt trapped by her own mind. Master Hikaru listened attentively, his wise gaze unwavering. After Mei finished pouring out her heart, he leaned forward and gently placed a pebble in her hand. This pebble, he began, represents the burden you carry. It may seem small at first, but when held onto tightly, it can become overwhelmingly heavy. Mei looked at the smooth pebble perplexed by its significance. She had expected a profound answer, but the simplicity of the object puzzled her. Master Hikaru, how can a pebble help me find peace? The old monk smiled warmly. Take that pebble and toss it into the stream, he instructed. Observe its journey and learn from it. May, though skeptical, obeyed the master's guidance. She stood by the edge of the stream, raised her arm, and released the pebble. It landed with a soft plop and created ripples that spread across the water's surface. May watched in awe as the pebble continued its voyage downstream, carried away by the gentle current. Master Hikaru gestured for May to sit beside him once again. Notice how the pebble flowed effortlessly with the stream, he said, his voice serene. It didn't resist or cling to any obstacles in its path. It surrendered itself to the natural flow of the water, allowing the stream to guide its journey. May pondered the lesson in silence. As she observed the stream's gentle flow, she began to grasp the profound wisdom master Hikaru sought to impart. She realized that just like the pebble, she needed to let go of her burdens and surrender to the natural flow of life. Days turned into weeks, and May remained at the monastery, continuing her conversations with master Hikaru. Through his guidance, May learned to embrace the present moment, to let go of past regrets, and to release her fears of the unknown future. She discovered that true peace could be found by accepting life's ebb and flow and trusting in the universal wisdom that guided her path. Months later, May bid farewell to Master Hikaru, her heart filled with gratitude and a renewed sense of purpose. She left the monastery, carrying with her the teachings of the wise old monk. With each step, she embraced the stream's lesson, allowing the ripples of her own journey to touch the lives of others and spread the wisdom she had gained. And so, May became a beacon of peace and serenity, sharing the tale of the pebble's lesson with all those she encountered. The ripple of Master Hikaru's wisdom flowed far and wide, carrying hope and tranquility to all who listened. In the end, it was through May's own transformation that she understood the true essence of enlightenment, 
the realization that within the ripples of life's journey, lie the boundless wisdom of the universe.